Hey guys, not all three, and I am back playing Just Ignore Them, number two, episode two, I should say. And the last time I kind of stopped, uh, I couldn't figure out the flower or whatever. We got the vent, it says their monster lives in there too, he never really comes out, I think it's mommy's perfume, so I know the flower goes somewhere over here. And we are going to mess with it. Wall, vent, there's nothing too much to, mouse hole? It goes in a mouse hole. Obviously. Okay, now the wall smells nice, and so does the vent. So now, okay, we need maybe the screwdriver. There we go. Nice, nice. The screwdriver open the vent. We go in the vent, and hopefully I didn't die. I didn't die. Okay. That's creepy as hell. That wasn't creepy at all, no. no. Uh-oh, go this way. What's this red? Is that blood? Does that mean I'm gonna die? Uh, what's this? This something right here. There's a small slot here. It's scratched with a number, 910. Okay, so maybe at 910 we can go in there. Okay, that won't work. Okay, so let's go this way. So we're inside the vent right now. And now we're in a bathroom. I don't need that. I usually take baths, but that water does not look inviting. Alright. Bathtub, 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 bathtub. Cupboard? Let's look in the cupboard. I know mommy's key is somewhere in here. Aha, I found it. Okay, I got the key. I got the key. I got the key. Okay, we don't need that. Toilet? It's just a toilet. Hmm. Should I go or just hold it? Uh, I'm going to... Okay. Uh, I'm thinking that if I say yes, I'm going to die. But we're going to do it anyway, just to see what happens. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, that... Yeah, I just got a, t a toilet just ate me. <laughs> that was a thing. Okay, do we have the key still? All right, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, can I get out? Oh, wait. Okay, so we're not doing the toilet. Uh, okay, let's click on it. Anyway, we'll say no. I better hold it. Okay, we're not going there. And maybe we can leave now? Can we leave? Oh, uh, hello? There we go. I was like, can we please leave? Okay, so we got out of the bathroom. Off the room. We're going to mommy's room. You had the spare key, dude. Okay, so maybe we have to do it like this. There we go. We're not going in the closet again with a smiley face. That was bad. So now we should be able to go in here. Mommy? Mommy, are you in here? Your mommy's dead, dude. Your mommy's so dead. Your mom's so dead. Oh, oh. <laughs> she really... Oh my god, I was so joking. Uh, she is dead. <laughs> Looks like she got cut in half. And his eyes are like so big around. Like... She's just sleeping. Yeah, that's she's sleeping, dude. She's good. Mommy, why are you playing? I mean, I can save you. This is just a bad dream. He's clear. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing at this. And there she was, laying in a pool of her warm, shiny blood. That's morbid. It's funny. Uh, I thought it was funny at first, but I, I knew this was coming. But I what? But I wasn't fast enough. And now she's dead. Was it the toilet? Did your toilet? Did the toilet kill your mom? Thanks. Uh, okay. Can I quick pass something? Oh, thanks, Dad. Oh, it's, I think Dad's the killer. Hey, thanks for the coffee. Oh, I, I'm all grown up because I'm drinking coffee, so I'm a grown up for sure. Definitely drinking coffee. I'm a grown. -up. Don't mention it. We don't usually get customers at 5 a.m. except for you. Oh, really? Sorry about that. I couldn't sleep. 5 a.m. does not seem like an odd time to get a customer for coffee because everyone's starting their day. That's just weird. I mean, if they would have made it 3 a.m., that would be weird. What's on your mind, hun? Have, uh, well, you know, the feeling as if you're being watched. Yeah, every time I finish my shift, I feel like someone is stalking me. It's probably me or this guy. Why is someone stalking you? Well, sort of, look. Just forget. You probably wouldn't believe me anyway. Look, Mark, you've been in here every day for, what, five years now? What? 
Okay, so if this guy's in here every day for five years, I think I know who's stalking you. <laughs> you knew you could talk to me about anything. Yeah, I know. Remember when I told you about my mother? Who can forget it? It was all over the news. I still remember when I was a little girl. September 4th. That's weird that you remember the day his mother died. The date. That's weird, dude. If you want to talk about her, you get pretty upset about when that happened. I say yes. No, it's okay. I want to. Okay. When I found her body, there was something else in the room with us. Who? Did they murder your mother? No, she wasn't murdered. Do you know what day it is? Well, it's September 4th. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Sorry, Mark. She killed herself. What? Uh, okay. No, it's not okay, but what I'm about to say definitely won't believe. Try me. It was a monster. Monster, look, Mark. You're under a lot of stress. Told you you wouldn't believe me. Sorry, Mark, for a little far-fetched for me to believe, but I am sorry about what happened. It's okay. Blah, 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 blah. What about the start story from yesterday morning after you found your mother? Oh, okay. Yeah, right. All right, she wanted to hear it. All right, it's still 5.30. We don't open till 7. Oh, so he's in there before they open. Okay, after I found her body. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Hey. Uh, where do I go now? You're driving when you're... What do I do? Is he driving as a kid? No matter what, they will still follow me. Till I give my last breath, they will find me. I hope she is safe. Sorry I mentioned them people. Die. That's just weird. Uh, what? Did chick just kill herself? Is she hanging there? What? I have to keep on the road. I can never go back now. I've lived here for too long. Met too many people. This is still all I have ever known. And nothing will ever change that. Okay, this is weird. It's freaking me out. There's no hope. Help me, Mark. You're my only hope. Only pain. It's going to be another six hour drive. Better stop and rest. Okay, so we got a hotel. So the chick that I've been seeing every day for five years just killed herself? That's. They shouldn't follow me this far out. Need to get out of the rain. Okay, so I'm getting a hotel, I guess. Alright, let's go. Uh. Toolbox? I'll take my screwdriver. Well, it's the only tool in here. I should really buy more tools. I, I still have, after whatever, if I'm at 18 and I was uh, 8, after 10 years I still only have a screwdriver. I wonder if it's the same screwdriver, because it looks the same. Oh, here's the trash. Nope, nothing in the trash. How do I get in there? Oh, I bet I gotta go up this way. That's a, Yeah, that's the balcony. I was thinking that was inside. Let's go over here first. Uh, nope. There's vents. We don't need to vent yet, I guess. I'm gonna go over here to the radio. Come on. It's a radio. That'll still work since it's been in the rain. Let's try it anyway. Yeah. Oh, it's a grill. We still use some sort of roadkill. Ugh. Should disturb the other guests. Room three. See nothing special about it. Shit, peep, that's rude. I can't do anything with it. Okay, so let's go back up here. It's an old vending machine, and the prices are outrageous. Uh, okay. okay, come on, get up here, dude. I think so, sure, uh, what's the, what is this? It's a. Uh, is this the office? Like, yeah. Oh wow, hey, look at the ceiling fan icon right there on the floor. There's a ceiling fan, and look at the shadow. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's go talk to this turkey. Hey, what's up? Well, howdy there. Welcome to Dayfield Motel. My name's Old Bill. How can I help you? I'm looking to spend the night. Do you have anything available? Well, I do have something. It ain't pretty. It'll keep you dry. Thank you. Say, so, do you call yourself Old Bill for anyway? You don't look that old. I said I'm barely 50. As a matter of fact, I just turned 49 the other day. Yeah, it's not old, man. I'm sorry I didn't mean to offend you. No, it's okay, son. I ain't ashamed of my age. Oh, no. Oh, one more thing. 
all the phones in the rooms work, but come see me if you need to the out call number. If I need to make a cell or a call, I know who to see. Thank you. So you can't make a call inside your room. That's weird. Okay, let's go over here. Computer. I didn't say better not. I said better not mess with it. I think. Huh? No tone. Must be a must be a call out number. Please tell me this isn't set for three o'clock. Better ask for a room first, but here is employees only. Sorry. Okay, so we're done, I guess. Did I get a key? Your room key. Alright, we're out. Peace. Thanks for the room key, dude. I don't remember paying you, but it's all good. As long as you don't care, I don't care. The fire extinguisher. This is my room? Radio. I need to need to see someone about a room for. I just did that, didn't I? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, this is my room. This must be my room. Well, isn't this the penthouse suite? Yeah, it's kind of got some ripped up carpets, and uh, looks like maybe those are supposed to be missing tiles in the bathroom and a broken mirror. And it looks like the vent's even messed up. It's weird. Look, they managed to remove almost all the stains from the bed. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, there's the phone. Can't do anything with it. Huh? No tone. Okay. Tell you. It's an old tone. It probably hasn't worked in years. Can't do anything with it. Uh, can't do anything. It's a creepy word of. There's a little scratch marks in the back. Probably from some small animal. Well, that's that's nice. Yes, let's see what the note says. It's a note. Dear guest, please do not try to open the glass side door to the balcony. The lock has been broken for some time, and forcing it will dislodge the door. That oh, will. This is really nice. Enjoy your stay. Well, I suppose there's nothing else to do. Till the rain stops. I wanted to go look at the bathroom before I laid down. Just fell back into the bed and gazed at the cracks in the ceiling. I thought I could finally have some time to myself. That's just weird. The more I gazed, the bigger the cracks would become. I had too much on my mind. I wonder if Mary was okay. She hung herself, dude. She would be opening for dinner right about now. If I return to her normal life, I'll ask her out on a date. Soon enough, I fell asleep. I felt cold. Very cold. Like when I walked into mom's room. Okay, that's freaky, dude. You're freaking me out, kid. It's happening again. In this, like, hotel room? I can't sleep. God, dude. You are the worst sleeper in the freaking world, man. I need to know if Mary's safe. I'll call the diner. Is she... She should still be working. I need the out call number. Better go see the man. Let's go look in here real quick. Uh, interesting concept, but looking for me, I don't need to go. Uh, okay, so we're ready to go out, I guess. I don't see anything else in there to do. Let's go in here. Let's go talk to the guy about getting the number. Baby, don't you lose my number. Huh? Where'd he go? Maybe I should look around. Where'd he go? I'm not a thief. Oh, okay, here we go. We're going to look at the register book now. This must be the list of everyone in the motel. Huh? Only two people. Me and someone named Paris Eve. Huh. That's weird. Go to the computer now. See what that is. Maybe he has an out call number on this computer. And it's password protected. Great. It says if I forget the password, find it on my birthday. If I forget the password, find it on my birthday. Oh well, that's convenient. That's strange. It's like someone has tried to enter the password. Better not tamper with it. 
Find it on my birthday. Maybe it's a. Uh, look, look at a calendar. And then. Okay, we're going to go for telephone. Maybe we need to find a calendar, and then we can let's go to the key rank. There's a strange looking key here. It says Bill's Happy Place. This guy has some issues. Did I take it? I did take Bill's key. What the hell, dude? You don't want to, like, do certain things, but you don't mind taking his key? Okay, so we're going to go check out Bill's Happy Place. <laughs> Wherever that is. Kind of scared because Bill's happy place could be. Uh, let's see here. Is this Bill's happy place? Okay, so we're gonna go down here. See if it's one of these. Oh wait, 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 wait! I bet it's this one. I bet it's this one. Huh. Maybe not. Bill's happy place is. Okay, this is weird. Can I go further this way? Oh, uh, there we go. I was going to say, can I go? Okay, here's a... Grill. Not that tight. Oh, oh, look. oh, there's Happy Place. It's because it's got the banner, of course. I'm nearly not hungry for wet food, but the coals may come in handy. I'll take some of the dry pieces from the bottom. After all, I don't bring any. Uh, what? What? Toothpaste. Toothpaste. And it's locked. And that's why we have a key. Three Bill's happy place. This doesn't look so happy. Um, well, hey now. Wow. I can feel the happiness already. <laughs> yeah. You know. Uh, let's go look at the poster. Someone has a good taste in women, uh, poster. Okay. No. Let's go read the note. Please do not touch the power box to the right. I have modified the cables to charge my truck's battery. Ooh. Lawnmower? Huh? Lawnmower? In the desert? Let's go look at the lawnmower. Possibly use the blades of this lawnmower. What? Could come in handy scaring off the critters at night. What the hell is going on? I don't understand that at all. Who picks who picks up who picks up blades? Uh let's not go to the power box. Useless. Unless there's a fire, I can leave it. Uh, let's go to the workbench. Let's go this way. I'm scared to hit the power box. Mm, what's with all the TV, old TVs? I haven't seen this much since I was a kid. Workbench, workbench. Uh, is there something in the drawer? Let's see what's in the workbench. Hey, an old oil can. I could use some. Uh, I could use some on the bed in my room. It squeaks too much. What the? How are you doing? And your bed's squeaking. Oh my god, dude. I'm so lost. Well, the washing machine still works. Well, that's cool. Okay, so. Television, workbench, we did all that. Uh, I'm not sure that I need to do anything here. Let's go over here and die real quick. Probably. The Kiko looks like it's rested. Maybe I can use something else. I hope this works. Okay, we got it. We got it open. Now what? Look at all those wires that I'm not going to touch. Hey, jumper cables. But why would Bill fuse these to the power box? Uh, I didn't get that. 
because he was trying to jump his truck with a fuse box for some hillbilly reason. Okay, so let's go back to the bed, maybe, and put the oil on it. That's what it sounded like we needed to do. Sounds stupid, but that was a hint. There we go. Let's go back to my room. Me too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't realize I had to use the key every time I went in and out. I thought once it was unlocked, it was unlocked. Alright, so we're gonna use the oil on the bed? I thought he just said he wanted to use it on the bed. Am I dreaming or what? Inviting. Uh, I'm not seeing anything kind of oh, stick out right stuff. now. I don't get it. Let's go back in here, right? Mm. Coal oil on his birthday. That's the other. He went. It's like, oh, I'm out. Peace. Uh, I'm not sure where to go. Maybe here? Can I go this way? different, that's for sure. Not really, really too sure where to go next. Hmm. Let's go back in here for a minute. Maybe I missed something. I don't see any critters. I wonder if I have to go inside that wardrobe. Oh, I need a key again. God damn it. Come on, come on. Hmm. Coal? Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think that'll do anything. Go back to Bill's place. Happy place. Let's see what's going on over there. Let's try to drive real quick. Shouldn't drive. Okay. That's weird. But we'll uh, let you think that, sir. So it's pretty cool how he grew up and he's now an adult. I guess we're going in there again. It's cool to have a keys. It's good to have the keys, yo. Alright, did I miss something here? Okay. 
That was different. Workbench. I don't need anything from here. Washing machine. Oh, we didn't do this. It's like an old fort hatch. I need something to pry it open. Like, ah, come on, man. I missed that. How did I miss that? Oh, the blade won't work? There we go. There we go. Well, how did I miss that the first time? Let's give this a try as I cut my hand off with the blade. Open. Oh. The hole's too tight to insert the blade. Lucky there was no one around to hear me say that. Oh my gosh. Uh. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Maybe the oil? Okay, I thought I had something big there. Let's give this a try. Probably the same thing, I would imagine. Maybe we need to go back over to uh, the electrical thing. So the jumper cables, I guess we can't take or whatever. Hey, jumper cables. Okay, there's no jumper cables. Let's go back to the workbench. Nothing's going on there. Television. I'm kind of, kind of stuck again, to be honest. Really stuck. Huh. Grill. Oh no, I got the coals from the grill. <laughs> Duh. Maybe we need to put the coals over here in this grill. Right there. Uh, let's go to the truck first. Let's go to the truck first. Uh, I'm no mechanic, but you never know what you might just need. Nothing going on there. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with that. Uh, can I use this key to get in here? It'd be cool if I could. Let's get a car. go back in here if I don't find it I might take a break well don't look that inviting okay he said something about using that won't do anything Tried toilet. Huh. Oh, I won't do anything. 
what is this up here? This is what I don't understand. This ser section right here that we can see. Looks like there's steps going up right there. Maybe I need to go more this way? Maybe I can go the maybe I can go this way. Maybe this will go this way. And I'm just not doing it. It might it might very well go this way. Come on. Move on over. Baby, it ain't over till it's over. Come on. I guess not. Alright, I'm stuck. Alright, well, this is episode two. I am not 003. We will make some more episodes of this. I am digging this game. I'm just at the moment where I'm stuck and i going to take a break, go make dinner, and be back. So, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think of this game. I think it's kind of cool. I just like the little pixel things. And now that he's grown up, he's not such a whiny little brat. And we'll have to figure out where to... I wonder if I have to get into another door or something, man. Uh, oil, charcoal... Yeah. We'll have to figure out how to get this. Uh, you know. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. What are you thinking? Yeah, we'll have to figure it out. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. Nano 3. Peace.